Can't pig, but I just don't believe in all that mushy, gushy, too juicy, lovey, dovey chunk. You just wait, Rolly. Some special starlit night. You'll gaze across a crowded barnyard, and there she'll be, a glow around her, the air filled with music. Uh, it'll hit you like a bolt from the blue. Yeah, yeah, right. When pigs fly. <laughs> Daddy, don't you just love my new bow? I spent hours arranging it. Am I not a swan, d -run? Darling, you are prettier than a sty full of day old slop. Hmm. Get a bunch of mush. Cat Pig doesn't know what she's talking about. I guess. <laughs> These jump birthday candles. <laughs> Oh, I love 
if that were possible. <laughs> This makes sense and it's gonna work positive. Like I said, the way to make girls notice you is to be cool. And to be cool, you gotta look buff. But this thing is real tight. That's the whole idea. Nanny wears pantyhose all the time to hide her unsightly bulges. <laughs> What's wrong with a little bulge? It just means there's more of me to love. <laughs> jewelry chest? Actually, his tool chest. And now, for the final touch. I can't see. That makes you the luckiest one here. Don't listen to her. You look great. Now, let's see you are cool. Yeah, let's try it again. Anybody ever tell you what beautiful eyes you have? <laughs> oh, what's the use? Face it, guys. I'm just a klutzy loser. No, Rolly, that's negative thinking. Your only trouble is you've been going about this all wrong. It's time to get in touch with your sensitive side. Just what is it you're getting at? You know, be gallant. Woo her with words. But ever since you told me I was in love, I get all tongue-tied around her. Well, if you can't reach down into your inner poet, then I'll just have to supply the words for you. Are you ready, Rolly? I don't know about this. It'll be easy. Just repeat everything I say. What? Oh, dumpling, beloved. Oh, dumpling, you butthead. He's dead. Uh, uh, your eyes are limpid pools, and your lips are cherries. Your eyes are lizard drool, and your lips are hairy. You know you do this. No, no, you do this. Oh, yeah, of course he gets that right. Are you sure this is working? <sighs> <sighs> pretending to be someone I'm not. Being me is all I can handle. But, Rolly, true love is... Uh, if this is true love, you can have it. I'll take corn fritters. In fact, I'm gonna stuff myself silly with them. Ooh, you have corn fritters. <laughs> I just love corn fritters. Have you ever tried them with a nice steaming trough of day old slop? Oh, no, it's really good. Is that fritters with some ketchup and Whoa. some sauce? Will you look at that? All he has to do is be himself. Who knew? Corn fritters and chow, 
beach, corn fritters in a blanket, corn fritters in powdered sugar. Thunderbolt, what's keeping you? The plague of frogs is coming. That's harsh. Thunderbolt hates frogs. I never doubted you for a moment. Tebow rules. Hey, late models for utility vehicle arriving. these farm animals as extras. <laughs> what is this? Some kind of miniature cow? That, sir, is a puppy. No, oh, we'll make it work. <laughs> Who are you? You are lucky people. We're going to use your farm as a location for our TV series. A TV series? No kidding. Which one? The only one that matters. Thunderbolts P.I. Did you hear that, Lucky? A real thunderbolt right in our own backyard. <sighs> We're going to need to build a barn and a silo. And, of course, a windmill for the big chase scene. Uh, Mr. Dallas, they've already got all that stuff here. It's a farm. I want the reason! This is so cool. Maybe I'll get to be in a scene with Thunderbolt. Maybe. But it looks like you got some competition. <laughs> What's this? A television shoot? <laughs> Why, it reminds me of my own performing days in the fourth grade. <laughs> From the heartbreak of cavities, I played the lead molo. Weird old two feet wound and swell. Ideal. Perfect. <gasps> That's what the review said in Playground Magazine. I must have this car in my seat. <laughs> Star on the set. He's here. Sure thing, Pop. Where's my trailer? Over by the oak tree. I'll show you. I'm your biggest fan. Seen all your movies. Indiana Bones, Dog Star Wars, First Bloodhound Part 2. Uh, yeah, yeah, great. Uh, listen, uh, how would you like to scrounge up some lunch for me, huh, Pop? Okay. A croissant and mineral water if you can find it. You're okay, pup. Bash the poop on. Ah, there's a sport. Mmm. 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 Okay, quiet on the set. Lights, camera. How totally cool. And action. <laughs> That crook doesn't stand a dog biscuit 
best chance in the kennel. Thunderbolt can climb like a monkey. Cut! Great work, Bolt! Bring in the stunt double. Huh? All yours, Francois. And... Action! <laughs> Then I use an aloe moisturizer, which really brings out the uh, highlights in my fur. Oh, it's my naturally curly tail. I couldn't lay it without moisturizer. Thunderbolt, you don't always have that poodle to your stunts, do you? Like that pyramid stunt in Indiana Bones? That was you, right? You're the world's bravest dog. Excuse me, but I'm Come here, Donna. I'm afraid of heights. Stand it! Emotional scars spring to mind here. <laughs> Thanks, kiddo. <laughs> I can't believe it. You're nothing like the real Thunderbolt. You're just a, a stuffed sweater. Yeah, but it's a designer stuffed sweater. <laughs> You're a fake. I'll bet you never did a brave thing in your entire life. Ready to do my own stunts. Just like jumping into a haystack. And I would need some bogus poodle. Man, these TV windows are just as fake as TV heroes. Yeah. Maybe he's right. Maybe I am just a stuffed sweater. Lucky? Lucky! Hang on, pup! I'm coming! Come on, my way. Yeah, I'm, I'm good as hell. Yep, here. Here I come. Oh, boy. Bring in the stunt double. You're a fake. I'll bet you never did a brave thing in your entire life. you a chicken thunderbolt you don't know the meaning of fear ah, you're wrong lucky i was plenty scared just now but i thought heroes were fearless yeah so did i but maybe not remember in indiana bones when my character overcame his fear of frogs to rescue his pal sure that was awesome well he was a hero all right not because he didn't have fears but because he overcame them hmm well, if that's what makes a hero, you're still the biggest, bravest, best hero ever. And maybe if I overcome my fears, I could be as big a hero as you. <laughs> 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 